My name is Lisa and I've been training with WBK Boxing since 2005 and I've been coaching since 2010. For me, training on a professional level helps me be the best coach I can be. This is actually my prim primary job. I'm now a full-time coach with WBK Boxing. So for me, I know that I have to lead by example as a coach. So I focus not only on perfecting the techniques as much as possible, but also on pushing myself to that higher level of performance. For me, I have to be accountable for what comes out of my mouth when I'm coaching. So the question is, can I back it up? My philosophy when training is boxing is silencing that inner voice that says you can't. For me, it's all about believing you can do it no matter how hard that punch out is. Boxing is the constant pursuit of perfection. That's what it is for me. There's always something to improve on regardless of what level you're at. And that's what I focus on. What is it that I need to do to be absolutely perfect? I know that there's no way to get perfect, but that's the challenge. The pursuit of the perfection is really what drives me. When it comes to coaching with WBK Boxing, my philosophy is essentially striving to equip the boxers with the skills they need to succeed. So to me, it involves more than just doing the demos and explaining the techniques. It's actually empowering them with the belief and the confidence in themselves that they can master those techniques. So I look for ways to connect with the boxers so that what I'm saying to them, what's coming out of my mouth, actually means something to them. So I try to adapt to each boxer's personality and demeanor. So the most important thing for me is pushing them to their limits since I absolutely believe that everyone who does this training has it in them to surprise themselves. Generally, I'd say my fulfillment from coaching comes whenever my specific feedback helps a boxer finally grasp something that they've been struggling with for a while. So to me, it's striking a chord or turning on that switch in a boxer's mind or in their body. So when I hear so a boxer say to me, hey, thanks, that really helped, or wow, just changing that small thing made all the difference, that gives me immense satisfaction. And uh, I especially love the smiles I get after a tough punch out and the boxers leaving saying thanks, coach, even though I've just kicked their asses, basically. So knowing I gave them that tough workout, but I, they was, that I was also able to push them to push themselves, it actually gives me a high. What I admire most about WBK boxers um, is their determination, their toughness, also the ability to laugh at themselves. Whenever someone's trying a new skill, regardless of what level it is, you know, sometimes you look kind of silly and you have to kind of forget about what you look like, not be so self-conscious and just, you know, if you screw it up, you screw it up. Um, also the passion for this crazy training. I mean, it's something that I think everybody who sticks it out they, the passion just grows and grows with each level. And lastly, for me, it's the pride. It's like we're all a member of an elite and an exclusive club, and we all know it. Whenever I'm talking to anybody who's looking to join WBK Boxing, I tell them straight up, it's hard and it's not for everybody. It's not for those people who say, oh, I think I want to you know, get in shape, I haven't been exercising lately. It's not that kind of a workout. But I do tell them, if you're looking for an amazing, challenging, truly exciting and different kind of workout, be prepared to fall in love and never look back.